check the brake fluid level on a Volkswagen, first you want to open the, the hood, you know, park the vehicle in a secure place, then open the hood. Uh, it's better if the engine is cooled down so you don't get burned. Um, it does not affect the level on the um, brake fluid reservoir. Now, the brake fluid reservoir is going to be on the side of the driver, usually close to the firewall over there. So it could be covered as well. In this case, it's not. You can see it's right there. Um, right on top of it, you have the correct the recommended brake fluid type is printed on that label so it will say typically dot three it could be dot four it could be dot five whatever it says in that cap that's what you need to use um so we will first check the level and to do that you want to look carefully on the side of the reservoir right here and uh, let's take a look closer so right here you have the minimum it's right down there and you have the maximum and the level is right it's a little bit difficult to see, but it's right about that minimum right there. And you want to double check as well. So use a clean cloth, clean the top here. You don't want any um, dust to fall in there. Then you go ahead and remove that. And you can see that we have a uh, brake fluid. So another reason why you might have a low brake fluid level, other than a leak, which should be addressed immediately, is that your brake pads are probably getting close to needing to be replaced so have that check as well if uh, your if you, your level is really low um, you don't want to ignore that brake light it could be very dangerous for you and passengers and others on the road so address that immediately and do not drive with the brake light on sometimes the issue could be something electrical um, on these cars so the brake light stays on because this sensor right here the sensor measures the level that could be wrong, it could be a wiring issue or a problem with the ECU and the car breaks completely fine but you do not know that unless you diagnose the car um, so do not drive it even if the car seems like it breaks fine do not drive um, with that brake light on um, just for your own safety